Hello, I'm Mary Ludwig Case, but my famous nickname is Molly Pitcher. I was born near Trenton, New Jersey in 1754. I don't have a large family like many others, but I'm not an only child either. I have an older brother, Johan Martin, my mother, Margaretha, and my father, George. Both my parents were German immigrants, so I never did learn to read or write. I grew up on a farm with the rest of my family. It was 1774 when my first husband proposed. I was only 20, but I said yes. His name was William Hayes. I couldn't have been any happier. Then, in 1775, the Revolutionary War broke out. William was a patriot, so I decided to follow him to war. My husband would help load and fire the cannons, and I would bring a pitcher of water to cool the burning hot cannons when needed and to provide cool water for the men. Then, on one fateful day in 1778, it was the Battle of Monmouth. As usual, William was running the cannons, and I was getting ready with a pitcher of water. Then, I heard it, like any other cannon shot, but something felt wrong. I looked only to see my own poor injured husband on the ground injured by fire. William was my first thought, but then it hit me. Only two men were left manning the cannons. I ran over, instincts kicking in. What was I thinking? I couldn't load and fire a cannon, but even the thought and sight of my injured William didn't stop me. I kept going, and that's how I got my name. No, not Mary Ludwig Case, but Molly Pitcher. Yes, I'm sad that William died from that fateful day in the Battle of Monmouth, and I miss him dearly. But I have met someone new and unique in his own way, John Macaulay. In 1780, my beautiful son was born. I moved in to Carlisle, Pennsylvania with my family after the war. I had moved a lot in my life, and I'm glad to finally settle into one place. I died in 1832. Remember me.